Our minds are naturally uh, beneficial. The nature of our mind is, is naturally beneficial. So everything that appears in our mind, in, of, as and through, we can say is perfect, exalted, flawless, spacious, pure, <coughs> clear, <coughs> perfect opening intelligence. This is what open intelligence is. If you stop thinking just for this moment, just for a split second, just pause all descriptions. <clears throat> we see that there's just this alert presence, this alert cognizance. This alert cognizance carries throughout stopping thinking, it carries throughout starting thinking, it carries throughout disturbing thinking, it carries throughout uh, exalted, uh, those, those special ones that you, you call uh, positive and um, those ones that you really, really want to hold on to and those ones that you really want to avoid. This open intelligence carries throughout and is our ability to perceive all of these thoughts. So in the Balance View training we just house thoughts, emotions and sensations, uh, all people, places and things, into the simple category of data. <clears throat> the simple title of data. It makes it really simple to, to look at our experience just like this. That there is open intelligence, this ability to perceive all data. And we also start to see gradually that open intelligence is inseparable from each and every occurrence, each and every appearance. And so this is an introduction to the nature of your mind, an introduction that I was, <coughs> that was quite foreign to me to be introduced to this, uh, this nature of my mind as perfectly beneficial. I didn't know that about myself, that everything that is, that is appearing for me was natu is naturally beneficial. I thought some things might be, some things might be, but there was a lot that was out outside of that. There was definitely a lot outside of that. Some things were tiredness. There was something up with me if I was a little bit more tired than usual. Other things like irritation and anger and frustration. All of these things were seemingly uh, something that I needed to get rid of and something I needed to avoid, replace, indulge. All of these uh, uh, old styles of uh, dealing with these appearances. And so here in the Balance View Training, we're just given a simple choice to either uh, continue on with this analysis, descriptions, emphasis, uh, old ways of relating to ourselves or to take up a new and empowered approach which is to clarify, to rely on open intelligence. So there's that simple choice again and again in each and every moment to either go after these descriptions or to rest deeply in our powers of opening <coughs> intelligence. This forever expanding intelligence that is just inherent to us. And so Balanced View is just here to provide the support to make that choice and to make that choice a reality, to make it uh, a day-to-day -day life reality. And the topic of, of self-love, it's, it's so important for, for my life and for everyone's life, I feel, <coughs> and for great change to occur, because I've seen that's the only way that has really implemented some immediate and lasting change in my life to to start with myself to start with myself in this uh, with this simple choice that I was speaking about to choose open intelligence this is the greatest form of self-love and the greatest form of uh, social activism or or uh, the basis for world peace 
So uh, coming to see that in my experience, I saw many, many things occurring around the world. Uh, organizations doing this and that and people choosing this way and that way and, and lots of nice uh, things. But in my experience, I was very disheartened and uh, just a bit jaded in, in, the, in that this, these things could actually uh, uh, affect any real or lasting change because I just didn't see it coming about. And so in my experience, the moment that I took up this opportunity to, to test out short moments, and that's what we just offer you, just an opportunity to test out open intelligence. In my experience, I saw that that was the solution that I was looking for. And so uh, I never really, I just totally put all of that aside, all of the, uh, the ideas about maybe um, influencing some beneficial change in other people's lives. I just didn't see it was possible because I couldn't really see any lasting change in my life. I saw many techniques and practices and um, exercises come and go in my experience and leave me with disappointment disappointment after disappointment and and the next thing after the next thing and and so I, I was quite taken back to see that there was actually some change coming about in my experience just by allowing everything to be as it is and it may sound contradictory but there's a support network to actually see that 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 was the case in my experience so I would just utilize the short moments utilize a trainer, utilize this training and utilize the, the community. This is a support structure called the Four Mainstays, which is unique to this training, a full comprehensive support network. But there's just always that simple choice to go into the dis to, to disempower myself and other people or to rest deeply in my total empowerment and my ability to empower others. And it's just really, really so much easier to do that. So much easier to, to make that choice. I didn't even know that that choice was available to me before coming here. What I saw was that there was these appearances and, and automatically I was a victim to each and every appearance that came up. <coughs> Tiredness, boredom, <coughs> anger, negativity, these things uh, led me around and, and dictated my, my thoughts, dictated my actions, dictated my speech, dictated all of my qualities and activities. But given this choice that there was just this opportunity to, to have a look at these experiences, really have a look at these. And so when I look at my experience right now, and we can all look at our experience right now, what do we see? <coughs> I see data arising in this perfect, clear expanse of open intelligence and everything appearing and resolving naturally, like this line drawn in, in mid-air, mid spontaneously releasing. This sound, this uh, lovely Indian music going on over here, appearing, releasing. Thoughts and emotions coming up in our chairs. And so when I look at my experience right now, my, my mind is naturally beneficial. Nothing needing to be done, nothing needing to be fixed about it. Self-love, love already present. Self-love already totally available. No need to then work on self-love coming about, maybe thinking some more thoughts today, writing out some extra extra techniques to, to get that self-love generating. Moment to moment, this simple choice to, to either take all these appearances to, to diminish us again and again, or to be our natural exaltation, that exaltation just meaning naturally perfect. 